Welcome to Get Ready to Profit, a show designed for entrepreneurs. Each episode is packed with ideas, tools, and inspiration to help you transition from dependence on a paycheck to financial freedom. Learn how simple it is to create a business of your own on either a part-time or full-time basis. Hear from special guests who share their wisdom, their ideas, and their stories of success with you. Your world is about to change for the better. Get Ready to Profit with Glenn Garns. Hey everybody, it's Glenn Garns and we're back with Get Ready to Profit. I know that it's been a while and I'm going to do a very special episode of the radio show today to explain what has happened since the last time we were in touch with you. And it's going to be a good story. So it starts with a community update, I'll call it, and an apology. So we're going to give you that in just a second. But I've got some exciting news to share with you, and it helps to explain why we chose to put a hold on the radio show until now. And I think you'll very be very pleased with the outcome and the reasoning behind it. But we've got some special stuff to share with you, and I want you to stay around for the whole show because we actually have an opportunity that might interest you if you are an entrepreneur at heart. So let me start off with the community update and the apology. You may recall that back during the summer, we launched Get Ready to Profit with the intention of bringing you a weekly radio show that was designed to introduce you to the opportunity that exists in entrepreneurship. This radio show was literally designed to help you move from employee mindset where you've been conditioned to look at a paycheck as your primary source of income to an entrepreneur mindset where you learn how to appreciate, develop, and value multiple streams of income in business and investment and otherwise. And the goal was obviously to give you a greater awareness of the opportunities that exist for you to create the lifestyle that you would really like to live. Most of us, as we know, are settling for what we think we can get instead of going after what we really want. So Get Ready to Profit was to give you a better vehicle to get to where you really want to be rather than settling for where you are. Now, with that in mind, Originally, the concept was to do this in the form of a radio show, a podcast, and we're still going to do that, obviously. That's why I'm coming to you now through the Get Ready to Profit radio show. However, there was something missing for me in the way that we chose to structure the organization or structure the, the show. The show was a great idea, but I didn't feel like it went far enough in aiding you to make the choices that you need to make to have access to the resources that you need to have and to get connected to the people that you should know that would help you to actually implement the things we'd be teaching on the show. In other words, our concern was, or my concern was, that I was going to get you all ramped up with these ideas and have no place for you to go. So I decided to pull back, and, I, and this is where the apology comes into play, because I probably should have sent, done a radio show episode to let you know that we were going to pull back and I decided to go back to the drawing board and to really give thought to how we could not only educate you, but give you the tools and the resources to actually get into entrepreneurship. So with that in mind, we have now evolved the program to become more than just a radio show, but an entire organization. And this organization is devoted to working with startup companies and what we call early stage companies, companies that have started recently, to give them the knowledge, training, resources, and connections that they need to be able to really sustain themselves and grow in the world of entrepreneurship. So with that in mind, again, I'm going to have an opportunity at the end of this broadcast to have you get plugged into this organization because it's brand new. I mean, this whole concept is brand new. Now, we're not brand new to doing these types of things, but this particular organization is brand new. But with that in mind, we're going to give you a chance to be in on the front end. We're, we're actually going to be doing what we call a soft launch, a pre-launch of the program by giving early adopters an opportunity to plug in early and be rewarded for that. So let me start off here by talking with you a little bit about what it is that entrepreneurs need to have access to. And then we're going to talk about what we've created to accommodate you. In my experience, and again, going back to my days as a practicing attorney, 
I represented business owners for many, many years. And what I saw them doing and doing very effectively was getting the most out of their resources, whether they be economic resources, whether it be technology, whether it be the people that they knew or the people that they hired to work with them in their businesses. They always made good use of their resources and the people around them. So I learned very early on that the first thing that entrepreneurs need is training. They need to have access to the information that prepares them from a mindset standpoint and a substantive standpoint to engage in the process of entrepreneurship. Entrepreneurial people are very creative. They're very persistent. They're very patient people. They see big picture vision. We all have the ability to do that. But sometimes when we get into the daily routine of a job, our ability to be creative is stifled because we're so focused on things like getting to work on time and doing our doing the things that are in our job description and whatever else it is that somebody else has decided we should do that day that we don't often get the time that we need to stop and think. Entrepreneurs remove them from those remove themselves from those burdens and they position themselves to take the time to create ideas. And a lot of that comes from understanding a few simple principles that come through training that's specifically directed to foster entrepreneurship, creative thought, vision, ideas, all those things. So the first thing that I know that entrepreneurs need access to is training. And that's something that a lot of people miss because they believe that once they get their degree from college or their graduate degree or some kind of certification in their business, that that's all there is to their education. Entrepreneurs understand the value of ongoing self-education, meaning that there's always something new to learn. They understand the concept that learning translates into earning. And so it's not something that you stop at any given point in time. So the first thing entrepreneurs need to have access to is training. The second thing that they need to do is to have an idea and a plan for how to implement it. One of my favorite mentors, Dr. Napoleon Hill, the author of Think and Grow Rich, and if you know a lot about Dr. Hill's works, you also probably are aware of his other publication, or he has many publications, but one in particular is actually one of his first, was The Law of Success in 16 Lessons, where he studied the most successful entrepreneurs, most successful business owners on the planet at the time during the industrial age, people like Henry Ford and Harvey Firestone and Andrew Carnegie. He studied what made them successful and distilled it down into 16 principles that he shared in that publication. So one of the things that Dr. Hill teaches is that success starts with your having clarity, a definite plan. I mean, a definite, clear plan for what it is that you want to do. I mean, a clear idea to be clear in your mind as to what you're doing. He calls that your definite chief aim. Now, your definite chief aim can be something that's a temporary goal or it can be your lifelong goal, but he recommends that you identify something specific and have enough clarity of mind to visualize yourself achieving it. The second step is to have a plan for how you will attain it, and that's what we're talking about here, is that every entrepreneur needs to have an idea, that's your definite chief aim, and a plan for how you're going to do it. And as you can imagine, if you were taking a trip somewhere, we used to use roadmaps, now we use GPS systems, but either way, in order for you to get from point A to point B, you have to have an idea of where you're going. You have to have an intention to go to a particular place, otherwise you find yourself drifting. And so with that in mind, your plan is kind of your GPS, if you will, for where it is you're going with your ideas. Now, the third thing, that you need as an entrepreneur is the cooperation of others. Being in business for yourself doesn't mean that you're in business by yourself. There are a lot of people that support your efforts to implement your idea. And it doesn't diminish the value of your having come up with your idea. It's simply a function of you need help. There are all kinds of people that come into your world when you're an entrepreneur, if you're starting a new business, you might need the help of an accountant, of a lawyer, of a business coach. You'll certainly need some support from other types of professionals. Someone's going to build your website. Someone's going to create your logo. Someone's going to print your business cards. These are all people that you need to have access to in order to move your business forward in the most expeditious way. So what Dr. Hill says is 
once you know what your definite chief aim is and you have a plan for attaining it, you then make a list of the people that you're going to invite to collaborate or to cooperate with you. Now, those may be colleagues. They may be people that are part of your inner circle, which we're going to talk about later. They may be people that are professionals that have specific skills that support your effort to move forward with your idea. Normally, it's a combination of all those people. So keep in mind that you're in business for yourself, but not in business by yourself. Now, of course, as an entrepreneur, you need certain tools to get your message out, to create awareness of what you do. Mostly today, that means having a website, having an online presence. It's usually a combination of your website and your social presence, whether it be on LinkedIn, Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, Instagram, Pinterest, wherever it might be, you usually have a communications infrastructure that allows you to tap into the people that you need to have cooperation from in your business. In some instances, as I said, it might be connections through colleagues. It might be directly reaching your customers. It might be reaching people who also serve your customers who can connect you to people who need your product or service. But these are all things that an entrepreneur needs in order to be successful in business. Now, there are a lot of other things, you know, that we won't go into detail with today that come into play as you build your business. But these core concepts or these core things are where it all starts in entrepreneurship. Now, the good news is that today these things are relatively easy to acquire. They're very, very simple to put together as a system. And a lot of that revolves around the technologies that we have available today. The internet has just exploded the possibilities for entrepreneurship. There has never been a better time than now to get into business for yourself because of the ease with which you can get connected to the right resources, the right information, and the right people. And you're going to see that in what I'm going to share with you right now. So training, a plan, an idea and a plan, connections, and then your own communication system, which starts with your website. Your website basically becomes the hub of your online presence. And it's so important to have a credible website because people look at your website the way that you used to hand out a business card. You know, they judge you based on how professional your brochure looks. Well, your website has now become essentially your brochure, but it's much more than that. It's much more... um, much more of an asset, a tool for communicating your message, creating awareness of what you do. And so with that in mind, every entrepreneur needs to have a credible approach to all of these areas we've just discussed. Now, again, we could talk about these. This this radio show could go on for three days and not cover these topics in enough detail to get to do them justice. But having said that, if you at least are mindful If you're thinking about getting into business for yourself, if you're thinking about creating a new income stream for yourself, because sometimes being in business is not just about starting a business where you sell a product or service. Business might simply for you mean creating new income streams through investment, all kinds of things. You still have to have training, a definite plan, a um, people to collaborate with, and typically some kind of communication setup where you're able to reach out to and connect with the right resources. So with that in mind, I felt when we first launched the radio show that even though our intentions were good, that there was much more we could do to be the source of these tools and resources that entrepreneurs need in order to be truly successful in whatever it is they're choosing to do. So with that in mind, I'd like to talk with you about a new organization that we've created And this goes all the way back to my years, as I said, as a practicing attorney where I represented business owners. I got a chance to interact with them, to see what makes them tick, to see what was important to them, to see what they liked about being in business for themselves, to see the activities that they engaged in. And truly, my own spirit of entrepreneurship was much stronger than my desire to practice law, which is why I gave up my law practice 14 years ago, actually going on 15 years ago now. Over 15, you know, about 15 years ago, I gave up my practice of law so that I could spend more time being creative as an entrepreneur. The practice of law was actually stifling my ability because it's so, so limiting and so conservative. It actually was stifling my ability to engage in creativity at a level that was truly edifying of what I wanted to do and where I wanted to be. 
and I am never going to look back on that as having been a bad choice. We've had some battle scars, and we've had some ups and downs, and we've had some great times and some struggles, but it was all worth it. I can say that from my heart, that it was all worth it. And this organization I'm going to tell you about is a perfect example of why it was worth it, because if I was still practicing law, I probably wouldn't have done what I'm about to tell you. So let me share that with you. We have created a new organization. It's an affinity group, a membership-based organization called Entrepreneur Mastermind. And the purpose of Entrepreneur Mastermind is to give entrepreneurs access, startup companies and early stage companies, access to the training and resources that they need to really accelerate the pace at which they can implement their ideas. You see, it's real important in business when you have an idea to create momentum. Momentum is what propels you forward and it keeps you moving in the right direction even when you have to change direction to know that you've got access to the resources that you need including the people to back you whether they're backing you financially or with knowledge or just with emotional support. You know, one of the things that Dr. Hill identified as being a key principle in the effort of entrepreneurs to move forward was the mastermind principle, which is where people got together to support each other. They came together in what he described as perfect harmony for a definite purpose. And that definite purpose could be to support each other's businesses, to pursue an idea together, to somehow enhance the quality of what they're able to accomplish through the efforts of others. And that's why we've chosen to call this organization Entrepreneur Mastermind because we're basically putting you in a position to be connected to other like-minded people who understand you, who support you, and who are looking for your support in return. So it's kind of like the largest fraternity or sorority or combination of those two of business-minded people coming together to create together. And so it's, it's it's just an incredible opportunity for people who see it, and I hope you see it. So with With that in mind, I created the organization with the intention of providing you with the right resources to get started in entrepreneurship or to accelerate the pace at which you can accomplish in entrepreneurship. So that's that's what that's the premise here. Now, again, this organization is for startup companies, people that are just making the transition. If you if you just decided that you'd like to try something different this year. You'd like to start 2016 off with the idea that you're going to create something new for yourself in the form of a business or a business idea of some type. Then this program is for you. If you've already gotten started with in business and you're relatively new to the concept, this program, this organization is also for you. If you are helping people who are getting started in business and who have already gotten started, but they're early on in the stage of their business process, then this organization is for you as well, because we also are looking for people to mentor others who are about to engage and embark on this journey. So with that in mind, I want to talk a little bit about what's included in the Entrepreneur Mastermind organization. We chose to create this as an organization because it really is comfortable to move forward in business when you're in the company of other people that are doing the same. They say misery loves company, but so does happiness. And happiness starts with being in the company of other people that inspire you, that encourage you, that support your efforts. And that's what Entrepreneur Mastermind is all about. That's the spirit in which people are joining, coming together in perfect harmony to support each other's businesses and their and each other's communities for that matter. So with that in mind, What we want to do is to make it simple and easy for you to make those connections. And that is, in essence, what Entrepreneur Mastermind was created to do. Now, with that in mind, let's talk a little bit about what's included. We talked about training being a central part of being successful in entrepreneurship. So we've got a learning center that has everything you need to know to get started in business, to administer your business to grow your business, and even to exit your business if you choose to get out and sell it. Some of us are not going to be in business forever. We might create something and make it available for sale. I just sold one of my businesses about a month ago, and 
I, I sold it because I to chose to go in this new direction to support entrepreneurs and the business that I had been working on, the one or one of the business I'd been working on was no longer consistent with the direction I wanted to go. But I was able to create that as an asset that had value to somebody else and therefore it created income to me that I have invested in creating this new thing that is truly a passion for me. So sometimes we create businesses to pursue them on our own and sometimes we create businesses to sell them to others. It doesn't matter what you're creating it for. The idea is that you should be able to get it created so that it becomes an asset to you in some fashion or another. So training is a major part of Entrepreneur Mastermind. We have our own learning center. We start you off by teaching you the mindset of an entrepreneur because it's very different than what you're used to as an employee. I won't go into detail with you here because it's all contained in our lessons in the learning center, but getting your head straight, adopting the right philosophies and principles, understanding the relationship between those philosophies and principles and your ability to be successful as an entrepreneur is very critical. So we start the lessons off with a mindset section module that is designed to help you understand what the attitude that you need to bring to entrepreneurship. And it's actually very exciting. I, I have to tell you, the mindset lessons are some of my favorites. We then take you step by step through everything from how to get a business idea to how to get it into a concept that can be pursued and implemented to how to create a business plan how to then get funded if you need capital in your business. There's a variety of different ways to get funded in business today. We have lessons on how to get that done, how to create systems in your business, how to make your business flow well, how to hire the right people or engage the right people to help you to move those systems forward, how to create marketing opportunities to create awareness of what it is that you offer so people will become your customer or your client. And of course, how to grow your business, whether it's through acquiring other companies or being acquired or expanding into other lines of business. These are all things that happen along the path of an entrepreneur. Now, they don't all happen at once. They'll happen when, they're, when you're ready for them. But you have to be aware of them so that you can be on the lookout for when the timing is right for you. So our training center covers all of that kind of information and we also have a mastermind discussion forum where as you are looking through and watching the video lessons, we have video lessons and downloadable files and checklists and things of that nature that will all be available in the learning center. As you're doing that, you're going to have questions and we have a place for you to get those questions answered by experts. Remember, we talked about the connections that you have and the people you're inviting to collaborate or to cooperate with you. Part of that is having access to leadership coaches, business coaches, idea coaches, lawyers, accountants. We have access to people who can answer your business related questions in an online discussion forum that's available only to our members. So now you've got a complete team of people that are looking to participate in the success story that you're about to create. That is truly extraordinary. And I'll tell you why. When I first got started in the practice of law, I had to go out and find all these people. I didn't know who my accountant should be. I didn't have a business coach. I didn't even have someone at that time to discuss what I wanted my law firm to be about. I had to learn all that the hard way. And so this organization is about helping to shorten your learning curve and give you greater access to resources at an earlier point in your history than it, than it happened for me. And that's why I'm so passionate about this, because I know that by doing this, creating this organization, I'm making it possible for you to move faster in business than I did. And that's exciting to me because I know that the impact that we can have on local communities is accelerated by the pace at which we can grow business opportunities in those local communities. And that is essentially our goal here. Help you succeed so that you can help others succeed. I can't think of a better thing to do in business. So I am very excited about this whole concept. So we've got the learning center. We've got the mastermind discussion forum online in the mastermind discussion forum and in the training center. We're also going to teach you how to develop a business plan, how to develop a marketing plan and how to develop a workflow for your marketing in terms of where you're putting your message out and finding the people that you're looking to serve. So that's all included just in the learning center alone. 
Now, one of the other things that we know that you need is connections. And we're going to teach you the Napoleon Hill mastermind process. And what I mean by that is Dr. Hill had a specific way that he recommended that people get together, come together in perfect harmony and adopt a, a, a definite chief aim or a definite purpose for their group meetings. He called those mastermind groups. And he used an example of one that was so powerful that nobody needs to challenge this concept once you understand this. But Dr. Hill pointed out that Thomas Edison, Harvey Firestone of Firestone Tires, Henry Ford of Ford Motor Company, and Thomas Edison's right-hand person, Edwin C. Barnes, were all members of the same mastermind group. They used to get together at regular intervals to discuss ideas, to brainstorm, to be a bas basically a miniature board of directors for each other and support each other's businesses. Now, I don't have to tell you who those people are. They're household names even today. And the bottom line is that they knew and understood the power of getting together with other like-minded people to support each other's businesses. And nobody can challenge the success that they had, that they the, the things that they accomplished and the success that they had. So if you need a litmus test for whether being in a mastermind group and understanding what to do when you get there is important, just think about that. Harvey Firestone, Henry Ford, Thomas Edison, Edwin C. Barnes, one of the most powerful groups of people ever to engage in entrepreneurship. That could be you. If you adopt the right philosophies and engage with the right people in your business. So we're going to teach you that process. Our goal with every member is to position you to find the right people to be in your group and then teach you how to get the most out of each other's expertise and energy and support. It's a reciprocal thing. Everybody benefits by being in the mastermind group, and we're going to teach you how to create those benefits and how to make it very powerful for yourself. So that's going to be part of the work that we do with you in terms of helping you to make connections. On the connections front, let's think about this as well. This program is going nationwide and eventually worldwide. Our goal is to get 20 people in each state just to get started, to get part, to become part of the organization, and we want to quickly grow to at least 100 people in each state. That would give us 5,000 people across the United States that are all part of this organization. Now imagine that you'd be connected to all of them, and they would all be learning the same things that you do, understanding the philosophies that you do, looking to support what you do, and you'd be doing the same for them. You could travel anywhere in the country and know that every city you went to, there's somebody that's a part of your business fraternity that's looking forward to seeing you come into town and taking you around and touring and creating opportunities for and introducing you to the right people, the people that they know. Imagine that, being able to be so well connected that you can go anywhere and do anything in lightning speed. That's the power of being connected to the right organization. And that's why I felt compelled to pull back from just doing the radio show and actually create something extraordinary and special. So I hope that you agree. I hope you see the vision for what we're talking about here. We're not done yet either. So one of the other things that business owners need access to, of course, is the right resources to market themselves and especially on the internet. And I know because I have built websites and I use technology, I'm a big technology buff. I, we have a full TV studio, radio studio, event room. We live stream. We do all kinds of things in here that are cutting edge. And the bottom line is that everything I learn, I bring to you. So I want you to understand that when I create something, it's always with an idea of how it enhances quality of life for the people that are part of my circle of influence. And being a member of Entrepreneur Mastermind makes you part of my family. And I take my family very seriously. I encourage you to talk to anyone who's part of my family. They know that I'm always on the outlook for, or always on the lookout for opportunities for them. So with that in mind, let me just share what we're doing. Most of us know that in business, you got to have a website. Most of us don't have a credible website because of what websites cost. We have developed an approach to building websites that allows us to make them available to you in a way that is so affordable that it has to be a no-brainer. In fact, 
when you find out what it costs to become a member of Entrepreneur Mastermind and you understand that you've got the training, the mastermind groups, the connections, the mastermind forum, and your own website and lead generation system. Now, what I'm talking about a lead generation system is a specific protocol and gener- and, and uh, information pages that allow you to specifically attract the people who are supposed to be part of your client base, to give them an opportunity to get on your mailing list and enter into your so-called sales funnel. I don't like to call it a sales funnel, but it's actually your awareness system. In other words, you're educating them through exposure to you on the different ways that you have to be of service to them so that they can consciously make the decision to become your customer. Lead generation is key to growing your business and having a lead generation system is key to growing your business. We don't want to leave anything to chance. So we're giving you the ability to have a website hosted on a platform that we've created in WordPress. The reason I'm mentioning WordPress is because WordPress is one of the most popular content management systems, platforms for building websites on the planet. And it's well supported. And it means that you can move it anywhere you want. If you ever decided to leave Entrepreneur Mastermind, you could take it with you if you wanted to. You can't do that with a lot of the site creator programs that exist out here. And even if you could, the site creator programs don't have the same level of functionality that are that is built into WordPress when it comes to features and things that you can make your WordPress website do. We build all of our websites in WordPress today, and that's a testament because I, I, I was originally very hesitant about WordPress. I had a content management system that I really loved back in the day. When WordPress came out, I poo-pooed it for the longest time until I realized that I was being the direct opposite of what I was supposed to be, which was open-minded to new technologies. When I started exploring it and peeling back the onion, I saw the power in WordPress, and I got in early. And because of that, I've basically become an expert on how to make WordPress become the hub of your online presence and all the different things that it can do and should do to facilitate your business. So we're going to give you, in your membership fee, a WordPress website with very high level of support. We're, we'll, be, we'll be hosting it for you. We will be updating the uh, software regularly that supports the, the WordPress platform, both what we call plugins, which are software programs that extend the functionality of WordPress, allowing you to create discussion forums and allowing you to create event calendars and all kinds of things. We will be supporting that by updating all of your software, keeping it secure, and making it possible for you to focus on your business and not having to worry about maintaining your website. Now, let me be clear about this. If you're adding new content to your website, that's going to be up to you. But we will even have lessons in the Learning Center on how to manage your WordPress website, how to find people who can help you to manage your WordPress website. It's not a very pro- it's not a difficult thing to do. If you can send an email, you can add content to your WordPress website with a few button clicks, and you'll be able to see that in the Learning Center. But here's the point. Most people pay anywhere from 1500 to as much as $3,000 or more to build the kind of website that you're going to get included in your membership. If you are looking at this from the Entrepreneur Mastermind website right now, Take a look around the Entrepreneur Mastermind website because that's the kind of website that you have the ability to have by simply being a member of this organization. So think about that. Now, I want to cut to the chase a little bit here. I know in my heart that one of the fastest ways for people to put themselves in a position to achieve more is to start harnessing the power of their ideas. You see, most people that are in an employment situation are getting paid what their position is worth, not what they're worth. They're getting paid what their position is worth. And the reason that that's important is because if you are getting paid what your position is worth and not what you're worth, you're automatically set up to underachieve. It's kind of like going to the Indianapolis 500 in a passenger car and expecting to be competitive in that race. You need to go to the race in a race car if you want to be competitive in that race. And so what we want you to understand 
is how to get yourself into the right vehicle to achieve at your highest level. And I will tell you from personal experience that people will always pay you more for your ideas than they will for your labor. You might even want to write that one down. People will pay you more for your ideas than they will for your labor. If you understand that, then you understand why entrepreneurship is such a golden opportunity for you when you do it the right way. You get access to the right resources, the right people, and you put the right energy into it. See, the reason you have a job right now, if you do, is because somebody else had an idea. And what they did was they got you to cooperate to build their idea. Nothing wrong with that. If you're happy with that, there's nothing wrong with helping to build someone else's idea. But if you want more for yourself, which is why people go into business, which is why they explore entrepreneurship, which is why they look for something more, then you need to start preparing yourself to get paid for your ideas. And we teach you how to do that step by step. We teach you how to come up with your idea. We teach you how to implement your idea. We teach you how to market your idea. We teach you how to support your idea through your business infrastructure. That's what entrepreneurship is all about. And it's, as I said before, it's never been easier to get into business for yourself than it is today because of all the technology that exists today, including the internet. So we keep you on the cutting edge of all that. The other thing about the Learning Center is that we're updating that on an ongoing basis. Every time some new technology comes out, we're keeping you on the cutting edge of it. So you don't even have to look around. I mean, we encourage you to look around elsewhere because we, we, we may not see everything right immediately. But the point is, if all you did was stay plugged into our learning center, we're going to be updating that continuously to keep you on the cutting edge. I insist on keeping myself on the cutting edge, and I'm simply sharing with you what I'm learning. And I can promise you I'm an avid learner. I stay on top of what's going on out here at all times. So with that in mind, if that's all you did, if you're not doing any of that now and all you do is stay plugged into our learning center and our updates and what we're doing over here, you'll be in very good company and be getting very good information and support. So let me tell you now about this special opportunity to be an early adopter. It's automatically exciting to be part of something when it's first getting started. Imagine if you were one of the first people on Facebook or the first people on LinkedIn, or if you were the first person to support Bill Gates when he started Microsoft. There's a lot of very wealthy people that came into Bill Gates' world, and he made them wealthy because they were early adopters of his philosophy. They supported him, and it paid big dividends to them, still paying big dividends. So that's the opportunity that you have here with Entrepreneur Mastermind. Like I said, this organization is supported by our umbrella company, Village Connector Community, that operates a 6,000-square-foot facility where we operate a TV studio, a radio studio, an event venue, online streaming TV and radio, all kinds of things. Public speakers, trainers, coaches, authors, and educators all come in here to use our facility to create online education like you're going to see in the training center. You're going to get introduced to some of those people. And you're going to get special opportunities to plug into their resources and the things that they know. So let me tell you what that looks like for you right now. We actually have two different opportunities for you to get started with us. You can actually get started with everything I just described to you. The training center, the mastermind forum, your own website, getting connected to others, local and regional events, virtual events, all designed to position you to have access to everything you need to be successful in entrepreneurship. You can get started today for just $67 a month. Now, I can tell you right now, if you called a web developer and asked them, would you build a website for me and let me pay in increments of $67 a month, they would probably laugh and hang up on you. But that's not a laughing matter with us because that's exactly what we're doing. Now, here's the even better news. If you pay the $67 a month for 12 consecutive months, and this is only during the month of December, if you pay the $67 a month for 12 consecutive months beginning in December, you will be able to have a lifetime membership to the organization. And in other words, when you've made your 12th payment, you will never pay again for your membership in Entrepreneur Mastermind. 
There'll be a small monthly fee of just $5 a month to maintain your website. Imagine that. You can't even get a hosting account for 5 bucks a month, let alone a full website supported and maintained for you. $5 a month to maintain your website after you have paid 12 consecutive payments of just $67 a month. Most people I know spend more than $67 a month at Starbucks. And I know that that's not building their business. So think about that. Think about all the other things that you invest in or spend money on during the course of a month that do absolutely nothing to put money in your pocket. Now, with that in mind, we have another opportunity that I think is even more powerful. That's a great opportunity, and I encourage you, if that's where you are, to take advantage of it. But for those of you who really see the vision and are willing to pay a one-time payment of just $697. For one thing, you'd be saving yourself about $107 off the annual fee that turns into a lifetime membership. You'd be getting an immediate lifetime membership for just a one-time fee of $697. And when you pay up front in that fashion, you then pay $5 a month for your, for your website, just like everyone else does, but you don't begin to pay until month 12 like everyone else does. Here's how this works you now get a 30-minute personal consultation with me or one of our other team members to go over your marketing plan personally. In other words, if you go into the Learning Center and you watch the lesson on how to create your marketing plan and you draft the marketing plan for yourself and you send it to us, we're going to critique it and give you feedback personally. We're going to get on the phone and go through it with you step-by-step step to make sure that it is tight and that you didn't miss anything, and that you were on the right track at all points. I can tell you right now that based on what the hourly rate is for that type of consulting, that that's worth $697 just by itself. So imagine what it would take for you to go out and do all this on your own if you had to go out and find business professionals to support your efforts in this connection. We are serious about helping you to make 2016 your best year ever. And the truth is, I haven't even told you the half of what's coming. I can't. There just isn't enough time. I can tell you that this is just the beginning, though. You are going to have the opportunity to plug into even more resources, and that's why the lifetime membership option is such a powerful thing, because you only pay one time, and you continue to get upgraded and grandfathered into the other resources that we create in the future. Now, from time to time, there may be resources that require a fee, but as a general rule, the updating of the Learning Center, the events that we host, virtual events and things of that nature, all those things will be available to you by virtue of your lifetime membership. And, of course, being able to stay connected to people who, like you, understand the value of entrepreneurship. I don't know that you could invest in yourself in a better way when it comes to getting started in entrepreneurship. I don't know what else is out here that costs you $697 or $67 a month that does everything that I just shared with you, but I can tell you today that even if there is something else out here, you should have this too. And for that reason, I'm inviting you to make the decision now to get in on the front end of this so that you have the ability to ride the wave the longest. We're going to continually evolve this program. We're going to continually bring you new resources. We're going to connect you to people who can help you to get the job done. And when you look back on the decision that you make this month, you're going to be very pleased with the outcome. You're going to be one of those people that says, wow, I'm so glad that I made the decision to become a member of Entrepreneur Mastermind. That's what got me to the point of success. So right now you might be listening to this audio from the Entrepreneur Mastermind website at GetReadyToProfit.com, www.GetReadyToProfit.com. Or you might be watching this as a YouTube video that actually has visuals to it. We're going to be converting this into a PowerPoint presentation with the audio track, just kind of sharing some visuals of some of these things. And that will also be on the um on the Entrepreneur Mastermind website as well. But here's my point. If you're not watching this from the website, 
go over to the website and get our contact information and give us a call. I'm making it my mission to speak with each and every new member before we process their paperwork. I want to talk with you. I want to make sure that this is the right fit for you. I want to answer your questions. This is important to me because this is part of my legacy for humanity. It's important that we attract the right people and help them to develop the right frame of mind to get the most out of this program because we're basically preparing you to be an ambassador that goes back into your community to do good and to do well while doing good. There's no reason in the world why your being able to help others doesn't help you. And so we're going to teach you how to get what you want by helping other people get what they want. That's a Zig Ziglar phrase. If you help enough people get what you, what they want, you can have everything that you want. And we're going to teach you exactly how to do that in the form of entrepreneurship. Now, you may have questions, and I invite you to call and get your questions answered. You can call me directly at 800 306 6488 extension 1 that's 800 306 6488 extension 1 and when you call that extension you get me personally now i may be on the line i may you may have to leave a voicemail but i promise anyone that calls a return call within 24 hours so please don't hesitate to pick up the phone you can also email me directly at glenn g l e n n at glengarns.com g-l-e-n-n-g-a-r-n-e-s.com glenn at glengarns.com if you email me and you want to talk sometimes it's easier for you to send me an email and, and just ask me to give you a call at a time you specify or otherwise i'll send you back a email let you know what time i can call but either way call or email and let's have a conversation Let's explore whether the Entrepreneur Mastermind Organization is a good fit for your goals and your definite chief aim. Let's explore whether we can be part of your success story. Now, that's going to do it for today's purposes. I hope you're as excited as I am. I can tell you right now, this is going to be an extraordinary way to start off the 2016 calendar year and beyond. But I can tell you also that joining Entrepreneur Mastermind may be the most important decision you make if you're serious about getting a business off on the right foot, please give us the opportunity to help you to do that. I know that the resources we've created can help you to enhance the quality of life for yourself and for others. And we'll welcome the opportunity to work with you on that basis. So that's going to do it for this episode of Get Ready to Profit. I am excited to have been able to share this with you. There will be some more updates as we have further developments. We're working on a book that I'm going to talk with you about a little bit later because, as I said, I can't share it all in one sitting like this. I do need for you to be able to follow through on some of the things I've already given you. But I can assure you there's more to come and more reasons for you to stay connected. So on behalf of Entrepreneur Mastermind and Get Ready to Profit, my name is Glenn Garns. Thank you for listening. We'll see you again soon. Thank you for listening to Get Ready to Profit with Glenn Garns. Glenn invites you to join the Partners in Profit Club, the free Entrepreneurs Affinity Group, which includes complimentary digital downloads, membership in Small Business CEO Lounge, and their private social network. Receive advanced notification of events, resources, and other information members can use to advance their projects. Visit GetReadyToProfit.com.